Hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is the Asha Labaz, and today I am doing a wig uh, makeover. And so I'm just showing you the instructions that I received from inside. This is with um, Oxy Hair, I Oxy Hair. And um, thanks to them, they gave me two wig caps, but unfortunately the color does not match my scalp. So, um, or my hair, shall I say. So definitely I have a black and brown, um, a dark brown uh, stocking cap that I can put on my head to go under my wig. And so I'm just unraveling and um, taking out a package and um, some more of their labeling. And yes, let's get into it. So, First things first, gotta wash it. Listen, Corona, coronavirus, she is on the loose. So I just wanna make sure that um, everything is clean, sanitized, and um, yeah, before I put anything on my head. And um, just wanna go ahead and wash her. Um, Cause like I said, you know, with all the packaging and everything, we just don't know how many hands done touched her. So, and please don't come for me. Yes, I used the last bit of my baby shampoo. Um, had to put some water in it to make it stretch. Yes, it's time to go to the store. So, don't laugh at me, okay, y'all? Y'all know what's up. Y'all been there before. But anyways, I'm just doing a nice little wash and um. I don't know if you can see it, but I did have to put that hair net on um, just to wash it so that I don't get my nails caught up in the curls and make it more frizzy. And um, now I'm just going in with the conditioner. And I'm using Shea Moisture because I just figure, hey, if this brand is good for the babies, it's good for my synthetic hair. So, done drain the water out. And um, now, I'm just kind of getting it ready to put on my head and I um, got my stocking cap on now it done dry by now um, just a little damp but I'm gonna go ahead and size it up to my head make it comfortable and fit and as you can see you got the two combs inside and an elastic band yeah, a little stretch there and um, I just realized that when I was editing this video, I really loved this wig before I cut it. And I'm so mad that I went in and cut it. Like, why did you do that, girl? Why did you do that? But anyways, <laughs> I'm a mess. Um, but anyways, yeah. I'm just trying to get the curls into formation so that um, I can just start trimming it around the edges. And just to kind of conform to my face. Um, I do have a very oval, uh, round shape head, so I'm just trying to make this wig work for me. This is cute, right there. I like that. Mm -hmm. I was trying to make it look somewhat natural by cutting it. I think that's really most of my approach and why I cut it is to make it look more natural and fitting to my style and my head and um, just checking the back making sure that it don't look too crazy back there and uneven Just picking it out with my wide tooth comb and just making it fluff and um, forming and shaping it some more to fit my face. All right, I'm back again. Hey, girl. Yes, the Asha looking all cute. I see you, honey. Yes, I do talk to myself. Listen, honey, you got to build yourself up and speak positive words to yourself, you know? So, anywho, I'm all dressed. I have a Zoom meeting. This was Saturday morning. Please don't come for me. Yes, I've been sitting on this video for a couple of days 
trying to do this voiceover. Um, this is no joke, okay? So respect to all the YouTubers out there that do this on a day-to-day -day basis. But yes, I'm just trying to fix the um, band so I can put it on my head. Looking like a rock star. I'm just um, trying to fluff the curls and pull through them. I'm so mad. I should have stepped up just a little bit into the light, but it's all good. I know y'all can still see this little brown skin girl. Yeah. I think I started, yeah, take off my earrings. I was like, mm, not feeling it with this outfit. My son over here gassing me up, just giving me all the compliments. Him and my husband approve of my hair, so that's always a good feeling. When the guys that you love and care about and cherish the most like your hair. So I'm just fluffing it out some more. Um, honestly, I'm just um, raking through it and trying to get that desired look. Um, I love big hair, so as you all continue to follow me in my videos and on um, social media, you will see that your girl is versatile and like a chameleon, okay? I like to switch it up, and um, I'm not the type that, well, not a chameleon, because I'm not the type of blend in, but um, I like to change, um, a chameleon does change, but anywho. Um, yeah, I like to switch it up, you know. I get bored, especially now. I get bored easily, and um, I'm in the transition of growing my hair out, so wearing wigs is a nice protective style for me, and um, I love to be able to switch it up from time to time, and it don't cost a lot of money. It's affordable and can still be cute, synthetic, human hair, virgin hair, whatever. Honey, it's what you make it, okay? So... I'm just checking the back, making sure everything is A-OK. -okay. And my little man has made it into the bathroom. So I just want to thank you all so much for watching. This is the end of the video. Hope you all have a great week. And thank you for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe.